show you how. And guys, today I'll be telling you how you can recover your PSN account without your date of birth. And I've made like many videos of this of how to recover your PSN account without your date of birth. Guys, let's say for instance that um, you didn't have your PSN account hacked right now. Let's say it got hacked like a few weeks from now, but this will still help you. So make sure you watch the entire video. what's good youtube welcome back to show you how and guys today what i'm going to be doing is finally finally explaining to you how you can recover your psn account no matter which country you're in so basically in the description down below if you go down there right now you will see a link that will then transfer you to a page that allows you to pick from any like a variety of countries that you may be in so yeah, you may be like in Brazil or any other country and it'll be like a whole list that will allow you to do this. And yes, I know it has taken me a long time to finally come to a conclusion on what will help all of you guys out no matter which country you're in. And basically this video is for the people who don't reside in the US. So like if you're in another country such as India, this will work for you. But if you live in the United States, then you should check out my other recent videos that I've done and you should be able to recover your PSN account 100%. And um, in order to do this method, it's, it's, it's a little catch to it. So the catch is one minute will cost one cent. So each time a minute passes, there will be a cent. So basically if you talk for 60 minutes, that will equal up to 60 cents. So just keep that in mind. What you need to do is you need to download an app on your phone. It doesn't matter what type of phone you have. You can use an Android or an iPhone, it doesn't matter. But you need to download an international calls app. And basically once you download the app, um, you're gonna call PlayStation and their phone number is 1-800 three four five seven six six nine and i will have this in the description down below just in case you forget it so yeah once you call them they're going to give you a number that specifically for you that you can call in your country so i guess somehow uh playstation have something like um a bunch of phone numbers in their system because there was one time i called them and i asked them about a pacific country and they were able to give me a number so yeah make sure you download the international calls app and it's only gonna cost you a few cents each call. So just remember that you're saving money essentially. So you're gonna call them and just say that you're not in the US and just tell them which country you're in and they, they should be able to provide you with a phone number that you can call. And once you call that number, there is a serial code on your PS4. So this is the, this is the, it's what you need to listen to right now. There is a serial code on your PS4. It may be on like the bottom or it may be like on the side somewhere. It depends on which model PS4 you have. It could be the Pro, the Slim, it depends. But once you call them, they may ask you for your, uh, your, P your serial code and you tell them that and you should be able to fully regain access to your PSN account, so. So basically what this is on this page is different phone phone numbers that you can use in order to contact PSN. So it has Argentina, Bolivia, Brazil. So it basically has all the countries that you can use in order to recover your PSN account. Because I know many of you who've been watching my channel are di from different um, countries and stuff like that. So what I have is a link down below in the description. If you go down there and click it, you will be able to recover your PSN account if you're in a specific country. But before you leave this video, make sure you go ahead and drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already like i said before i'm going to be telling you more into depth about how you can actually recover your psn account and what you can do is you can like get a you can get on the computer or you can get on a phone or any mobile device that you have in your home and you can look up the type in psn live chat and once you go to that live chat just make sure you type in your emails i mean your email and your type in your um your password and then you can type in your actual PSN name. And once you do that, all you have to do is click. All you have to do is verify that you're not a robot because, of course, you're not a robot, like I said in my other videos. And then they'll send you to a live chat. But wait, I know some of you guys have been getting the, um, the message that keeps saying that you have to call them. So just call that number that they have on the screen. It's going to be like an 800 number, I think. And just call them. And once you call them, they'll um, help you reset your PSN account password 
And it does not matter. Your age does not matter when you're doing this. So don't worry about any of that. Just make sure you have your um, account details right. And also, even though you don't have your date of birth, what you can do is you can get your... Um, there's going to be like a code at the bottom of your... Um, <coughs> of your PS4 or your PS3. Just look under your under your PS3 and you'll see like a code and you can give them that code and you'll be automatically be able to get your PSN account back just like that. So, that's um one way you can do it. <coughs> and another way you can do it is you can <coughs> go to Twitter, right? And there's this thing called PlayStation X or something like that. X PlayStation I'm going to say. And you can send them a message and then PS PlayStation will direct message you back and tell you all the steps you need to know in order to get your PSN password back or whatever you need back. Okay, so if my other videos didn't work, trust me, this one will work for you. So, and guys, let's say for instance that um, you didn't have your PSN account hacked right now. Let's say it got hacked like a few weeks from now. But this will still help you, so make sure you watch the entire video. Okay, so let's say if I'm in a country such as Australia. If I'm in Australia, what I must do is find somebody that's in the USA, which is United States, of course. You need to find somebody that's in the United States, and you have to get them this number right here. 800-345-7669. And this reason being is because most of the agents are in the USA. I know, I know this is sound crazy, but... Um, the PlayStation is really not worldwide with the like customer service and all that So that's why you have to get somebody from the USA to do it for you But I'm sure many of you who are watching this have friends in the United States that can help you do this And you just have to send your information over and like I said all you have to do is send them like your email your old password and your There should be like a code either on the bottom of your PS4 or either on the back It depends on which one you have like the slim or the pro it just depends. And you know, once you do that, you know what I'm saying, you you should have your PSN account back in like a week or so, but just imagine if you couldn't get it back at all. That's why I'm trying to explain to you guys different ways in order for you to get it back because I know one way could work and one way couldn't work, but that's why there's many possibilities that one could work. So if I tell you one, it could work for you or it couldn't work. But if I have many, one of them will work either way. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is you want to type in, go in a browser, and you want to type in PSN Live Chat. So this is the first thing you're going to want to do. Alright, now go to Contact Us, right there. Wait till it loads, okay? Now you want to go to Live Chat in the, wherever you live at, but I'm in the U.S., so I'm going to click Live Chat in the U.S. Okay, uh, now you want to go to uh, Sony Account Help. Click it again. All right. Now, once that loads up, you want to go to password reset. And it says, uh, let's see, you want to click on contact us. All right. So now what you want to do, you want to type in your first name, your PSN ID, and PSN online ID. But for today's purpose, I'm just going to type in something random so I can show you what to do. All right. So I'm just typing, let's say Pablo Escobar or something like that. Okay. So now I'm going to type in random email just. But you want to type in your email. Make sure you type in your exact email for your uh, for your last known PSN account. All right. So all right, that and then type in a random online ID. Twelve. Not a robot. You want to verify that you're not a robot. All right. So you want to check out the traffic lights. This one over here. Verify. All right. Now you want to click. Once you go all that, once you fill it all out, you want to click request chat. And just wait. And it should connect you. Wait a minute. Alright, so now it says our average wait time is up to 10 minutes. So you have to just wait. It shouldn't take 10 minutes. See? It just connected just now. Alright, so now what you want to do is you want to... It says, hello, my name is Lucas. How may I assist you today? Now you want to tell them your problem. So let's say, for instance, okay, I need help getting my PSN account back. So you just want to message them that. And just wait. You'll see them type in. They'll respond to you. So just wait. Sometimes it takes a few. They might take a minute or two. But just wait. Alright. Now you see it says that agent is typing.
All right, no, now it says, I would be happy to help you with your account. What trouble have you had accessing it so far? And just tell them that someone hacked your account or somebody reset your password and you can't, you're not able to change it back. So I'm going to say, uh, someone hacked my account. And for, I'm going to go ahead and help you out. So what you want to do is say, someone hacked my account. And tell them do you need my uh, ID from the bottom of my PS4. So it's basically an ID that you have to get from the bottom of your PS4. But I'm going to show you the ID that you need. I'm not going to show you my actual number, of course. But I'm going to show you where the ID is located on your PS4. Alright, so someone has hacked my account. Do you need my PS4 ID? My PS4 primary ID. Alright, so type in PS4 primary ID. says the agent is typing it says it says I'm sorry to hear that someone has login has your login information is the information you provided before the chat in the pre-chat form correct for the account you need help with so at this part I'm going to stop right now but I'm going to show you now where the ID is located once they ask you because once you make sure, make sure, but before you go to this chat, make sure that you have all your login information correct. But now I'm going to show you the ID that I'm talking about on the bottom of the PS4 right now. That's it right here. Let me zoom in for you a little bit. So right here, it says have your model right there. You see the model. It says CUH, all right? And then you want to, right here, you'll see like a barcode. Like, once you see like your grocery, your grocery items, you'll see like a barcode right there. And under that, that should be your code that you're going to tell them. It should be, let me see how many digits is it. All right. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Told me it was never gonna end. I'm at the top, never descend. Calling my name is going. Go to my pre be fluent. Look at the girl, she be front and won't come back till I throw some hundreds. Throw the racks and I tell it.